Yeah, come in, come in. Yeah, I wanted to see you. Mm-hmm. Well, I mean, to put it straightforward here for you. Um, I noticed your grades are slipping in this class. And, um, I mean, I know you show up often and you don't miss a lot of class, but you're always late. And you don't always show up to the online stuff, so. Mm, I'm just curious, is, is everything okay? Yeah. You feel like, um, I mean, I'm just asking, I'm just asking, because, you know, you feel like you overbooked yourself this semester, or you're just too busy? Hmm. Yeah. Well, I mean, it happens. It happens probably because you don't want to um, sit still. You know, you think being busy is being productive. You put a lot of pressure on yourself, don't you? I figured, you know, it's good to have high expectations of yourself and you know, push yourself, but, I mean, are you taking time to relax? You know, are you taking quiet time to reflect on your life? It's, it's scary, huh? It's scary to sit with your own thoughts and self-reflect on where you're going and what direction you want to go in and how you can be a better person. And You know, I, I get it. I've seen your study habits and um, the way you take notes. And you do, you do pretty good on the tests. You know, you really do. You, it's not like, it's not like you're, you're stupid or dumb. You know, I just know you can, you can do better. And I think you're a very intelligent girl. And I see your potential. I just, I want to get ahead of this before you, um, you know, you get buried in it. Hmm? Well, I mean, I, I do care. You know, I care about my students and, you know, I just notice these patterns have changed with you. Hmm? Well, I mean, I mean, to be honest, I mean, I probably shouldn't say this. Um, I mean, I noticed, dude, from day one that you walked into the class. Mm, I mean, I don't, <laughs> I don't want to cross any boundaries. Hmm? Oh, you want to hear it? Well, I just, <laughs> well, I'm hesitant because I'm supposed to be guiding you and teaching you. Oh, I mean, there's an attraction between you and I, I think. I mean, I don't, I could be wrong. I don't want to, I don't want to read it wrong, you know? But sometimes I see the way you stare at me. Mm hmm? Yeah, <laughs> why are you blushing? Mm hmm? No, no, look at me, look at me, don't. Don't get shy. I mean, am I wrong? <laughs> yeah. You see, I knew it. I knew that we had an attraction. And, you know, I uh, mean, me as your professor, um, I just don't want to cross any boundaries. And, but, <laughs> I, um, you're very attractive. I mean, that's just, uh, and I'm, and I know you're so smart, and I'm attracted to that. I'm drawn to you. 
And um, I think that's why I'm able to see that you're slipping. And I have this drive to guide you and want better for you. <laughs> and it's like this natural attraction. I can't, I can't explain it. I mean, how do you feel about it? Yeah. I mean, I don't, I don't want you to feel uncomfortable. But, <laughs> uh, yeah. I mean, now you feel the same way. Mm hmm. And what is it? Oh, really? You have thoughts like that? Oh. <laughs> yeah. You're pretty blunt, too, then, huh? Oh, when you're comfortable? Yeah, I mean... Uh, it's just... I can't help but... Like stare at you during class, you know. And I look forward to you coming here every day. Uh, I know I shouldn't say that. You know, I look forward to your class and seeing you. But I don't want to make you uncomfortable, you know. We don't have to... We don't have to talk about it, you know, we... We don't even have to explore it if you don't want to. Hmm? Oh. Uh -huh. you, you like older guys? Mm hmm I bet you like guys in authority roles too, huh? <laughs> oh, I knew it. I knew it. Hmm. Well, you know, I mean, I kind of want to make a move on you right now, but I want to make sure it's okay with you. I don't, I don't want to do anything we shouldn't do. And, and your opinion matters. And I don't. I don't want to get any one of us in trouble. Mm. But my attraction toward you is... Ah, it's so strong. Like, I've never, um... I've never experienced this before. And... I just, quite frankly, I don't know... I don't know how to handle it. You know, I'm torn between it and... I guess what I'm looking for is, what do you want to happen? Like, are you okay if we explore the options? Or the possibilities? I mean, like, I won't tell if you don't tell. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. You're so shy right now. Yeah, I mean... I love the confidence that you have, though. I can see it. Like, you're a very intelligent girl. I just think you take on too much. And you're always trying to stay busy. Like, how many classes are you taking? Mm -hmm, right. And, like, what kind of activities, you know? Right. <laughs> wow. You are a busy girl. I bet your brain is always going. Like you just can't turn it off, huh? Oh, I knew it. I knew it. Um. Hmm. Uh, are you, uh. 
Are you seeing anybody? Mm hmm? Well, I seen you talking to those guys the other day. And I just thought maybe. Mm hmm. No, I mean, I got a little jealous. Mm hmm. <laughs> I did. I got a little jealous about it because I was like, oh, I want to. I want to get that opportunity to talk to her. Mm, and I maybe get the opportunity to kiss you. Hmm? Oh, really? You think I get that opportunity? <laughs> mm, you're a little flirt. Hmm? Yeah. <laughs> uh, nah, I've been paying attention, definitely. You think I can, uh, you think I can kiss you? Just to see. Yeah, just to see if, if we have a connection. Hmm? Mm hmm. Come here. <sighs> Straddle me. Oh, look at that. Mm -hmm. This feels so natural. Uh huh. I want to kiss you. Mm. Come here. <laughs> Look at me. Mm -hmm. I think we have an attraction. I think I think there's something deeper going on between us. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Do you like dominant guys? Do you like guys that will hold you accountable? Hmm? No, I'm looking out for you. <laughs> I mean, I might know some way to turn your brain off. Huh? No, I mean, I... I just want you to know I'm not... I'm not just trying to hook up with you. No, I'm I'm not, and it, and I know I'm quite a bit older than you, and I have life, you know, experience that you haven't, you haven't, you know, explored yet, and and I get all that, but I would love to, I would love to mentor you and and guide you and hold you accountable, you know. Kind of be, oh, not kind of, but like I want to be your dom. Hmm? You know what that is? Oh, really? Like, I want to have rules for you. And when you break those rules, I'll, I want to be able to hold you accountable with punishment. Hmm? If your grades start to slip, I want to. I want to spank you. I want to reset your brain. Mm, have you ever... Have you ever had spankings before? Hmm? You ever had your hair pulled before? Hmm? Have you ever been... Choked before? How does that make you feel when you think about those things? Is it something you would explore or want to explore? Mm. Yeah. 
I mean, I would love to explore them with you. I think I have so much I could teach you and show you. You know, and I would um, take your needs in consideration and your wants and your desires. And I think I have more to offer you than the boys your age that just want to get into your pants. Yeah. See, I want to explore your mind. I want to know what makes you so intelligent. And I want to see if we can push you to do better. Because I know you can. I know you're smart. Mm hmm. I do. I believe that about you. And I mean, I wouldn't have. Uh, I wouldn't have called you in here. And I wouldn't be attracted to you if I didn't think so. I mean, I love smart, intelligent girls. Hmm, I do. It's my weakness. Man, I just... I just see something special about you. And, and not everybody's going to tell you that. And not everybody's going to be willing to see that. But I feel drawn to you. And I, and I think, I, I mean, I could be wrong. I think you're drawn to me too. Mm-hmm. And I hope so, you know. And I hope that's true. Well, I mean, what do you think? You know, your opinion matters too. You know, for us to work and for this to happen, I need you to be on board. Mm -hmm. <laughs> You're still thinking about those spankings, aren't you? <laughs> yeah, I planted that seed and you're still thinking about it. I mean, do you want to see if it works? Mm-hmm. I mean, uh, I mean, I don't have my paddle with me, you know, that's, but I do, um, let's see, I mean, if you want to, um, I have this ruler right here, yeah, I mean, nobody's around. I mean, I, we can lock the door. Mm hmm. You want it? You want me to lock the door? Okay. can put your bag down. You can put your bag down over there. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Come here. Stand in front of me. Look at me. If we're going to do this, because I have to feel comfortable too, and so do you, I need your consent. I mean, I don't, I don't want any one of us getting into trouble. And I want you to be comfortable too. This is not me trying to take advantage of you. I really want this between us. I want, I want to guide you. And I feel this need to teach you and explore you. I just need to know that you're on board with it. Hmm. You are. I mean, I'm not, I'm not keeping you here. I'm giving you the opportunity. 
I don't want you to feel forced. I don't want you to feel like you have to be here. I was talking to you about your grades and the direction you're going in, but if you don't want this, if you think this is a bad idea, you can walk out that door and we'll never talk about it again. And I'll never bring it up. I just, you know. Mm hmm. Do you want to explore it? No, me too. I mean, it's thrilling, it's fun, it's exciting. You definitely are the special, special girl I've been looking for. I mean, I didn't know. Like, I didn't know that you'd be the one. But I guess I put it out in the universe and, and here you are in front of me. And we have that natural connection. Hmm. I mean, I'm excited about you. Let me see your hair. Do you feel my heart in my chest? Do you feel how, how fast it's beating? That's because of you. You excite me. You bring this this burning fire out of me, this passion to guide you, to show you, to hold you accountable. Mm. And I think if I spank you with this ruler, mm, like what you just heard, want to be a naughty submissive for me? Click the link below and sign up. You can get all my naughty stories. Plus, sync downloadable stories with your toys. Join my Discord and get noticed by me. Do as you're told and sign up now. <laughs>